Let me share with you a one must have for security teams, automated email phishing incident response. One of the most labor intensive tasks that a security analyst has this day is picking up on suspicious email reports, trying to figure out whether it's a real phishing or not a real phishing, and collecting all those forensics in order to make a verdict. This time consuming task should and can be automated in a way that really used the analyst brain cycles to only make a verdict based on all the analysis that was already been done for him by a machine. The machine is doing basically all the labor intensive parts that the analyst would have done manually, collecting evidence, creating signature, looking for email patterns, saving him lots of time and tedious work and help him focus only on the things that we really want him to focus. Is it that simple? It's very simple when it's done correctly. By automating most of the process for them, at the end of the day, what they need to do is basically look at the entire incident response and make a decision by clicking on a button. Uploading tasks from security analysts by using automation is not just important in helping them focus on important stuff, always important in order to reduce the time that it takes from the moment that we realize that there is some kind of a phishing incident in one or more of the mailboxes to the time that it's being completely remediated. Security teams today must be built to speed. They must be able to respond very quickly because there are so many threats out there happening on a minutely basis that if they will try to tackle it manually, they basically lost already. By automating and orchestrating this process, we are basically reducing detection and response time from days, weeks, and sometimes months into seconds. And by being able to respond in seconds, we are making sure that bad emails don't live long in employee mailboxes. With technology and AI taking over our daily routines like driving a car, it's a no-brainer it will find its way to security operations. Is this the future? Definitely. <laughs>